There we go. I, don't, I, I didn't know what I was doing. I turned on push to talk, but it didn't tell me what button to push. So. <laughs> you gotta, okay, like, what a great intro. There we go. Okay, yeah. Uh, the, the, Is that it? Yep, yeah, that's it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, oh, so I got a, I got some questions that we're gonna we're gonna ask some boys. Uh, the first question, right. and then we'll we'll talk. Wait, more. are we asking you too? No, or well, it's like a it's like us? a group discussion, and then we'll just go off that. How, okay. about, how about that? Yeah. Uh, first I one. I tried this with Carter, and it didn't work. Yeah, dude. Well, this isn't Carter. So, how, do you guys know the game <laughs> Hamless Millionaire? Do you? What? Do you know the game Handless Millionaire? No, I do not. Alright, okay, so it's Wait. basically how much money? So someone's cutting mm -hmm. off your hand, but they're paying you. How much money for them to cut yeah. off your hand? And you cannot, re no, sorry, not your hand, your arm. And you cannot replace it. But are you allowed to just say no? Look, you're not cutting off Yeah, you hand. don't have to, but like, how much money for them for them to be like, okay, what's, yeah. What's the minimum? Or how much what's the minimum? do I want to What's do the it minimum? For? Well, if he offered me like 400, like, half of a million i would do it you do but for five hundred thousand. Like, i would at least want a million but if he said five hundred thousand, i'd be like cool i don't i don't know because it's like that's that's a pretty because if it's my leg honestly i'd be fine with it because you can probably prosthetic legs you can just put a stick in there but i guess you're not allowed to replace <laughs> yeah. it either. but you just get you a, have a stick in your leg. Yeah, yeah but yeah. man but like like five hundred thousand is life-changing but like I think your arm is a lot yeah. more important because that money's gonna be gone nowadays in like ten years, five years. No, and if you use it well, but like you know, I those just books. say no. Like you're not having. There's my no hand. situation Here, where it, you have to do there's no money. situation. Yeah. Like someone says, Everybody "I'll give you a billion has... dollars," and you'll you'd say no. Everybody okay, so we have to do it. I'm asking have... for like one point five. One point five million. Yeah. It's oh, my hand, wait, so bro. Is it what I'm asking for or what I would do it for? With the minimum. So Cormac's minimum is 1.5. Oh, I do it for like, okay, seven foot, seven fifty. Like $750 or $750,000? <laughs> <That's it. laughs> I'll tell you for a lollipop. Uh, I'd say seven fifty. What, like $7? <laughs> Pack of ciggies. <laughs> Your hand has great value. <laughs> oh, dude, no. Dude, do you know what you can buy with $7.50? Like a pack of gum? Dude, you can buy like three packs of gum. Come on. I mean, where are you going? What Go would you do it for, Mr. Question? Um, I don't know. Like, maybe like a million. Because I use my hands a lot. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you do. Like is okay, but it changes. Yeah. Is it your dominant hand? Like, cause would your dominant hand cost more money? Cause mine definitely would. I can. You know, it would, but still, my hand is my hand. About. Like, if it's my right hand, I'm asking like three for it. Oh yeah, my cause like my left hand is a piece of garbage. <laughs> but you still um, use it a lot more. I can things. learn to use my left hand. I've tried it. But before. it's like the only thing I use my left hand for that I can actually imagine missing is when i play a video game the analog stick to move jesus you're so freaking can you think of, can you think something else for you like hockey that's it like honestly wait for what for you hockey and for cormac like lifting weights yeah we if i didn't yeah, have my left hand my like stuff, like, but what else right, my left arm would be just picking completely... up a box you can pick up a box with your right hand no that like you so say you're moving or something or you're trying to move anything well, obviously it'd be harder, but like I'm thinking of things that I would do like maybe every day or like at least at least once or twice a week. You're not gonna be picking something uh, heavy up, especially when you have one arm usually. Live typing. Type it. I don't know. You're kinda is it your arm or your hand? I'm talking your whole oh. arm. Your whole arm? Yeah, it's like um oh, okay. Well you said hand before, surfer? so I'm I'm asking higher. I'm going fire. I'm like five. I Five million dollars. Five million dollars. That's a lot of money. Nah. I, for my I entire guess, arm, bro. Dude, but like, at some point, your arm becomes useless after the hand's gone. It's just a stump. Yeah, but you can still do stuff. Yeah, you still people, have no, is each a, inch a hundred thousand dollars? There's an NFL player without a hand. Is he good? Yeah, well, he's in he's the, in the NFL. NFL. Of course, he's good. <laughs> yeah, but like by NFL standards. 
I mean, everybody Maybe knows he who he have is. A hand. I mean, he plays for the Seahawks. The Chicago yeah, he's Seahawks. With his the what? What? Is it Chicago Seahawks? Chicago? No, Seattle. Oh, dude, I'm actually. Chicago has the Bears, I think, and they're the I worst thought... team. Dude, the Chicago Seahawks. Do you have coins? Did you watch the Super Bowl? I did watch the Super Bowl, yeah. I saw Shakira dance and it made me happy. I know, and I saw J Lo dance and that made me happy. I didn't I didn't even know it was happening. Like there was not it wasn't a big deal. Yeah. You said it wasn't real? I said it wasn't well, a big it wasn't, deal. Of course it was usually real. Usually the Super Bowl has quite a bit more hype. Yeah, than like it usually did there's a lot more well, like, people the, at least it's talk about freaking it. the it's because the Patriots weren't in it. Yeah, but, true. Do you think that would make it more popular because everyone wants them to lose and now they they can't win, so it's going to be someone new? Well, no, that's what we mean. They weren't in it this year, so it wasn't popular. Like, they want to see the This year it was Kansas City and... Yeah, you don't even... Okay, yeah, because yeah, Clark, if I tell you... Like, you do obviously say Patriots. Yeah. But hopefully you would. But if I say... Like, if I say freaking the 49ers, you don't know where they're... Dude, the Texas 49ers? <laughs> no. <laughs> Close. Dude, the Hawaiian 49ers? Uh, you know they had a, whim- a woman, a female... Uh, uh, Try again. Uh, a non... Non-boy? Non- yeah, non-male offensive oriented. coach. So they had a female coach? Guess so. <laughs> the white, you could have just said that. <laughs> You don't have to make it so difficult. I thought PG. I thought female was a PG. You thought female was a bad word. Dude, at least at least in the context. Some people are so like offended by even someone would be offended by that though. Like when you think about it. Someone's probably like, why does it, why does it matter that it's a female in the NFL? If you say coaching? something with enough something. If you say something you with enough make, something, oh well, yeah, of course you can. But like, you could be like locked up. Okay, no, you don't, don't name are a like dirty that. table. <laughs> yes, but you're like, a dirty table, bro. But if like, yeah, but that's not that be real. But if you like actually just start like crying or something, or like yelling at them, yeah. Yeah. What is all this? Don't name drop, by the way. Which what what? Don't name drop people that aren't here. Oh yeah, okay. No name dropping. Yeah, you little peruk. Alright. What what's the next question? Uh, I don't know. Hold on, let me check my Google document. Alright, so it's like it's kinda like the bear one, but this one this one can actually make sense because your guys' well, brains won't. You should actually... explain what the bear one is, because not okay, everybody so was how, here. Well they they can catch up later. Basically okay. how many What's the bear one? Well, yeah, we talked. Okay, how many lives would it take for you to kill a bear? I didn't make it. I don't. I. Yeah, how many lives? And they said it's impossible. And they like in billions of tries. What do you think Jimmy Kimmel would like associate you went on like a late? What would Kimmel? they ask? Oh, Jimmy, dude. It depends what you're going on for. Yeah, but like no, but why? What would you go on? For? Oh, definitely. Well, Jimmy Kimmel. Jimmy Kimmel has lots of stuff like. No, but like anything, but like so, like you sit down and. I would definitely like down. accidentally be okay. a hero somehow. And then it's like so was the, how many points get? But to be honest, you just uh, so what up? What do you? Yeah. You're real, you're real choppy there, bud. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, get to the question. No, the I question? want to talk about Jimmy Kimmel right now. I would talk about Jimmy Kimmel. All right. I, if I was I, going to Jimmy Kimmel show, I would do something like. Right? Um, no, what would you do? Yeah. Like a situation. You know what I'm saying? Um, I feel like I'd be there because I did a lot of one thing. Oh, so why? Why? Why are you, why are you there? <laughs> uh, I, I choose not to say. All right. Okay, dude. Dude. I feel like if I was going to be on Jimmy Kimmel, it wouldn't be appropriate. <laughs> it would be for something illegal. Yeah, or something like that. Yeah, Ooh, nudge, nudge. <laughs> Have you seen the show where the uh, the government owns the guy's penis? 
No. It, yeah. Should I look it up? Um. Put on safe search and then do it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like property of the government. Got it. Liv is texting me, so I told her to screw up. Dude, you should not name drop people, eh? <laughs> oh, that's a person. Oh. Golly. Hey, okay, I'm gonna Olivia. say my question. There we go. No, <laughs> Dude. Because it's actually short for Olivia. Stop. <laughs> Get back, <thanked>, y'all. <laughs> it's, it's fine. There's no last name. Okay. Um, how many clones of yourself would it take to fight a T-Rex? Wait, you have to ask that again. How many clones? So, yeah. you clone yourself, and it's all at once. How many of you would it take to kill a T-Rex? To kill a T-Rex? Full-grown T-Rex. <laughs> How many clones? Oh. <laughs> Is it a baby T-Rex? No, it's a full-grown T-Rex. <laughs> Is it a male? Male. I don't think it matters. Yeah, I'm going to guess probably around uh, like 1,500 because uh, well, I think I it will get outnumbered, this... but it's way more powerful. It depends if we are able to get on top of it because you have to climb up yeah. its legs. Because so so if it's, it's on, on its back, it's it's screwed. But if like you like, because it's gonna try to hit you with the tail, so you can climb up the tail though. No. No, that's your answer, Josh. No. Yeah. I'm thinking like maybe like five hundred. Five hundred? Yeah. No, more than that. I'm Boy, thinking. You're so wrong. I think no. I'm thinking more than that because, like, one swipe of its tail will take out probably 50 but humans. do you think a T-Rex will tactically use its tail? Like, when has it ever done Yeah, that? it did. There's when? proof of it. What? Since when does it have a tail it? move? You have a video of a T-Rex using its tail. <laughs> bro, where'd you go? Bro, where I did you find that? And where can I get some? I don't, maybe more than 500. Maybe I'm overestimating, like raw strength yeah, but Clark, it's a fucking dino yeah it doesn't matter you're coming from all ain't it's not like you're all coming in front it's of it you're coming from the biggest land map to ever roam the that's earth. just wrong the strongest that's just wrong as well no it's not name of stronger brontosaurus this are way better dude a brontosaurus would kick a t-rex ass in sheer no, strength really? In sheer strength? A brontosaurus or a brontosaurus? Brontosaurus. Dude, that thing's like a giraffe on steroids. There's no way. Like, T-Rex... Do you know what would win? Are you talking about, like, the really fat ones? No, I'm talking the ones with the big-ass necks. A Dipylodonculus? <laughs> Dude... I, they might have a fair hand against a T-Rex. Hey, you know, Clark. I think, it, dude, the only uh, reason a T-Rex could ever kill a Brontosaur is because the only self-defense it had was its weight, and if it snuck up on it and bit its big-ass neck, it would be destroyed. But if, if the Brontosaur just sheer, sheer strength, the Brontosaur wins every titanium. time. That doesn't matter. That's your bite. That's your bite thing, like your bite power, but sheer strength. Okay, yeah. So what? It's gonna pull out an AK. What else? Is it a make? brontosaurus. Just step on it or kick it. Step on it. Dude, you kill a T Rex so much what? faster than you kill a brontosaur. Literally, his the neck goes out so much longer. All the T Rex has to do is freaking just bite his neck. Dude, no, no, no. I'm not saying. Is, I'm not saying a T Rex. I think a T Rex wins that fight. I'm saying sheer strength, a stronger animal. Brontosaurus is easily stronger, but the T-Rex wins the fight. Okay, so fine. The best, the the fightingest, the fightingest the most dinosaur, dude. Man, the... land okay, well, guys, this is just like earth. saying like if me and Josh were to fight, Josh would actually kick my ass, no, but just out of sheer strength, I might win. You could just hug oh, you him. would win. So, I just like, think, I, don't know. I just think you would. But I, in a, in a fight, I don't know how to fight. He knows how dude, to fight. Just so grab him. <laughs> Literally, okay. you grab anyone this, this in this room. Different topic. This is completely different. It doesn't no. matter. It's a no, dude, like, this is a wacky do, podcast. How many, how many clerks does it take to take to beat? Uh, 
how many Joshes does I mean, how many mystery Lord of the Flames does it take <laughs> to beat the FBF gamer? And then how many gamers does it take to kick the dog, the don't form the gog? And then we go to the T Rex. I think fourteen of us could take the T Rex. If we have like really sharp rocks, like really sharp. Okay, well then you shank it. You go under it and shank it. Do you think it's gonna penetrate? It's a rock. Well, it's gonna penetrate, but it's not gonna. It's you said a very sharp. Yeah, no, 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 it's gonna penetrate, but it's not gonna go all the way through to vital organs. Oh no! But if you just keep shanking it, it'll bleed out eventually. Yeah, dude, you're just gonna sit down. No, like we're we're gonna go underneath it. It can't reach us because yeah. of its little stubby arms. Do you wonder why its arms are stubby? It's gonna shank it. I don't know if this is a fact. I'm pretty sure it is. Its arms are stubby, so it can't uh do things that for adults. With its oh, that adult is parts. not a fact. I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't think so. Literally, why else? Yeah. No, because they were so, all the time, they were so, like, horny. That's all they <laughs> could focus on. So their arms were shorter, and then they were like, ah. Oh, you go have hunt. to realize this is a structural adaptation that exactly. took a long that's time the, to make. That's the structural adaptation that was made. Because why else? There's no practical reason having arms that short. Oh, there's no practical reason why our arms aren't like that. <laughs> yes, there is. Do you yeah. imagine how incon like useless our arms would be? Well, no, because Clark, it didn't, didn't need to use his arms. But yeah. like, but why did they evolve like that though? In an adaptation, it's why not. Did we it's not going to. But because, it's not going to adapt to have something mouth. worse just because it doesn't use it. It's okay. not its mouth. It's now we're getting into it. Darwinism for some reason. <laughs> That's just, I think you're using the word wrong. <laughs> but, like, no, because the arms, like, even if that's not the reason, there's no reason that a T-Rex is arms, just because it doesn't use them, would get worse. That doesn't make any sense. Worse. Okay, well, here, look. Darwinism is the theory of biological evolution. So, this so it evolved to have shitty arms? There needs to be a biological reason for their arms to be shorter. There's no reason. Of... There's no reason. It doesn't need them for balance. It has so its tail. Because it didn't it, need them to be long, Clark. Yeah, but it could use them for, like, scavenging, like, their meat. Their meat? Or grabbing something. What are they going to use it with their arms? Their teeth, bro. Their teeth yeah. do that. Yeah, but it's not like... It's like... Do you think it's their like arms got in the way? Everything... Maybe that's why. Maybe their arms got in the way. It's I... Clark, now that we are Cormac thing, literally, why are we all... You're sorry. I want to hear your point. You're lagging the frick out. <laughs> God darn it! Like, there you go. Why? Well, now we're just not talking about it. Now we're just talking about everything. That's fine, dude. I don't think you realize when you. Oh, I know, but it doesn't need to. That's be like arguing. Why isn't every human on Earth the fastest and the strongest ever? No, but my point is that they evolved to be the slowest humans ever. All of them have evolved to be the slowest. Like, even if its arms were just medium and it didn't use them, I just don't understand why someone, the dinosaurs were like, we don't use these. Maybe that's why, because they didn't, so they just wanted to make them so it's like they weren't used at all, so they never got in the way. But even then, it's like, that just seems impractical. Well. Oh. Yes, everything is impractical. When it comes to evolution, everything is impractical. No. The rest of the T-Rex is perfectly built. Think about it. Every, okay, look. What's one thing on a the T-Rex? T-Rex, okay. If you think about it, a T-Rex, why doesn't it walk like a dog? Why does it walk on all, like, it's two feet? Because it's really tall yeah, and it's Jesus, better, it like, be bigger. It's easier to run. Thing. Okay, a giraffe is really tall. Yeah, but it's easier to run. Especially as a predator. So it can the pounce can't and jump be as well. like... Okay, were they like the fastest of the dinosaurs? Um, no, I don't think so. Actually, I don't even know. Because They'd in be my up, head, the clouds. four legs means faster running. <laughs> four, yeah, but like, let's say like, because when we were talking about brontosaurus earlier, if you had four legs, there's no way to reach it's uh the brontosaurus neck. But if you are on two legs, you can stand up easier and just you know, munch it. It's did you say this is boring, yeah, Josh? So I, oh. Yeah, we do. Like, I hope I get another 
But like, how many lives until life is too much? You know? Are you just like going on about the meaning of life? Dude, we're yeah, you, you cut out for all of that, and then your sentence ends with the meaning of life, and I'm just a little concerned. Like, no, what do you actually think we do when we die? Um, it's either rebirth or your conscience just goes away. Yeah, but like rebirth, that's fake. Oh, well, I don't like, know I then. Hope I get. I hope I get to do that, but like then. The population would just sit, sit in a standstill. No, I'm not thinking but like, like I'm not thinking rebirth as like a uh, you are again being born. I'm thinking you're born, but as a different person. So like your entity just goes into a different human being. Are we gonna stop talking about like a renaissance mm. of people right now? Because think about okay, Clark. But then after that, how many lives until what? And then the Earth blows up, and then there's nothing. Well, then it doesn't matter because we're all dead. Yeah, I know, but maybe, think about it. Maybe, have... like, there's, like, a, a quick save, and we'll, we'll go to back. What do we do when we die, though? It's, like, because like, maybe it's, like, because you know how uh, it takes a really long time for a planet and a star to form? Because mm -hmm. when you go to sleep, you don't actually have a conscience of time. Maybe it's the same difference. So it's, like, the, seven billion years later, everyone will wake up, or, like, two people will wake up. Maybe that's already okay, happened. Okay, so have you guys... But, like, how long is past it infinite? Interest? Because... How long I know is infinite? That's stupid, but like it's yeah, infinite you can't measure, you is can't infinite. It. Yeah, that's kind of the definition. Yeah, but if like then what? And like what? Is it? Then what? After infinite. So what's like the point? The point of life. Do you believe in aliens? Yes, there has to be scientifically. I hope you. There's no. You do there. right, Corm? Of course. I don't know about in our solar system, but yeah, I can see. Like, because there's people in, arguing uh, that there's like living crap on Mars and stuff because the water. There's bacteria. Do you know what I like to think? That we're what do you like, like to Horton think? hears a who, is not, is just science. <laughs> oh, bro! So there's elephants <laughs> and people inside of dandelions. Or like, no, that's terrible. You know how many dandelions you've probably blown or stepped on or lawnmower? <laughs> yeah, that's why we get quakes of earth. You make my earth quake. So how does that relate to Horton? Here's <laughs> the weed hacker. Dude, Doctor Seuss just did not just did not want any Horton, so he just summoned an earthquake. No, but just think about it. Everybody shush. Think about infinite. And you. <laughs> I'm just really confused how this relates to what news I do. I like, I can't believe the Illuminati hasn't shown up yet. We've so far <laughs> talked about T Rexes and their short arms, <laughs> infinity and life. And now we're on about Horton Hughes. Dude, <laughs> the, the Illuminati's just knocking on our door with the FBI. <laughs> Like you race. have cracked the code, and we must execute you now. We'll race you inside first, we'll get some wins. Speaking of the Illuminati, uh, do you guys believe in things like Bigfoot, or like the Loch Ness Monster? No. No? There's, uh, there's, just, there's species think... out there that we probably... We, we find like 300 new species each year. But, like, it's not that. There's not like... It's going to be a hair. We would know about it because, let's say, a Bigfoot, for example. They are apparently six feet tall and look like human. No, yeah, it's a, they look exactly like a Gigantopithecus. Yeah, so Which you would quick. think that's just the us being one. the most intelligent species on the planet would have figured it out by now, but See, apparently but they're just really We don't know that high. we're the most in, we're the most intelligent yeah, we known do. species. We're the most intelligent because we have opposable thumbs. But so does Bigfoot. And so does a monkey, an ape. I know, but monkeys are dumb. But if you gave a dolphin <laughs> or an eagle... Oh, dude, a dolphins would fuck us up if they had opposable thumbs, thumbs. They would literally... I know... Oh, like, right, that's not if you gave dolphin thumbs, and uh, I feel like them being in water is a disadvantage. But if uh, you gave them thumbs... The if they had opposable over. thumbs, the water would be advantage. Hmm? If they had opposable thumbs, then they would be in the advantage at all times. It is, and they're mammals, so they can breathe air. Yeah, and water. So is, they can yeah, live on both. And they be able and to figure out how to like smart. get. Food. They like sex too. I mean, intercourse. Children's podcast, by the way. 
Um, yeah. But okay, so hear I me out. Know. I don't think Bigfoot I is real. I feel like humans are dumb. I don't think Bigfoot is real because I think by now it would have been extinct. But I think things like like the Megalodon, Loch Ness Monster, those are definitely could be real. The thing is, though, a Megalodon, well, there's, like, there's you, physical evidence. Say, like, there's no, yeah, Megalodons, thing? they are still alive. There's, like, one alive somewhere. But, like, Loch Ness Monster... Are you going to say, like, that ocean thing, though? Because I agree with it. Like, what, 75% of the world is not explored because it's all just fucking empty water. With I think it's more than 70 I'm pretty it, sure it's more than 75%. Which is, like, we can get into that topic of, like, pollution and how we think we're making a difference with paper straw. Oh, yeah, dude, that but, doesn't matter. Like, like we could does, do nothing. But... We could... Like, I don't know. And then I was going to do an argument with Mrs. Immigrant, because I'm not going to expose her name. Oh, this is so much worse. <laughs> but, and then I told her that because I was doing recycling, and I came to a mental realization that we use the red, you know, the red and the blue bins that we use, and, like, one's for paper, one's for plastic. Relative? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they all go into the same recycling bin. <laughs> Dude, sure. At the end, no. <laughs> so there's no point. No, stop. But they have the cool labels on them. <laughs> there's the fourth boy. Benny Boo's here. The boy. Enter. Yeah, do I need to put anything so it records my voice? No, nah, I got you. You're fine. Okay. You're caught up. Um... The meaning of life is... Yeah, the, you're, you're cutting out, Josh. I can't hear what you're saying, Josh. Well, uh, basically, the translation was, Horton hears the life is the meaning of life, and Dr. Seuss will summon an earthquake. We're just waiting. Okay, what? <laughs> That's what we've discovered so far. The purpose of life is what? Uh, Horton hears you. Oh, okay. And then also, Ben, because we're on the topic, do you believe in Bigfoot? And, like, the, like, Loch Ness Monster, things like that? Like, uh, like, sir, like, stuff like Bigfoot as well. Yeah, like, just mythical like, beasts. Like, Sasquatch or whatever? Yeah. Like, yeah, just, just the, thing. just that kind of animal. Well, I believe there could be something out there. Like, there could be, like, something that we don't know. Maybe, like, it could be kind of mythical that in that we don't know it. Like, yeah, I think, because right? I think we're talking, like, ocean chance. The, the chance of something mythical, like a Loch Ness Monster being in the ocean, is super high. But things like Bigfoot, yeah, maybe we, not. there's so much that we haven't discovered. Like, yeah, it's a majority by far, like a large majority. Yeah. Or it's in like, the universe too. Even just like, like not, the not that long ago, they found those things. What do they call them? Like sea bears or something? Water bears? Oh, no, yeah. those are pretty the little old. microscopic. Yeah, dudes. yeah, water bears. They can yeah. live forever. Yeah, they're so like, stupid. They literally die all the time. But if they somehow don't die, they can live forever. So if nothing kills them, they live forever. Yeah. Uh, so those things are oh, epic. So, like, because they cool. can survive, like, space. You know, what's it? Uh, rats. Yeah. Last a long time without even eating. They're the longest thing to survive without water. Yeah, that's crazy. I wonder why that is. Approach, you could just step up and it's like. <laughs> oh, yeah, a cockroach can survive anywhere, can it? Like, a nukes? Oh yeah, no. If 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 the apocalypse does happen, I think that's a myth. I think that it's exaggerated to like kind of get a point across. I don't think you can nuke a bug and be okay. No, it's uh, they're not talking about f dropping a bomb on. You could squish it and they would die. Yeah, they're talking about the like the effects. Okay, yeah. What are you doing with your mic there, about... Ben? Pardon? Someone's messing with their mic a little bit. <laughs> can't hear you someone you someone's goofing around with their face. their mic make mic louder gosh stop messing with it i'm not messing with it someone is <laughs> what do you guys think of sleeping Wait. with socks on a gram is just like disgusting i that's just bad you should never do that if you don't know what that is kid Sleeping with socks on? Are you showing this to me? Josh, you're still like, you're still is like, it, yeah. is this like a question? Yeah. Like, yeah. what do you is think this of like people? Like a podcast for like you, the YouTubes? Yes. I yeah. Oh. Sleep. You're talking about sleeping with socks on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm just, just gonna edit it. you out of the rest of it. Dude, okay, yeah. You know, hunt. Did you only no? Did you only do? Uh, <laughs> Try again. Just leave and come back. We'll just pretend it didn't happen. You know, the seventy-five percent of shower without clothes on. I feel like it's higher than that. Yeah. Actually, wait, no, that's true. Frick. Wait, so what was the was the top, first topic? Who like sleeps with socks on? Yeah. Does that you. you do that? Yeah, I do that. All right. Ew! Oh, I can't even. Oh, you I can't even just... take off my shoes. Hey, ben, if I knew Discord better, I definitely would be kicking you right now, but I don't. So. This and is that's why disgusting. I'm talking to you over the phone. <laughs> 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 that's the actual disgusting though, because I can't even. Uh, I, I really I can't don't like that. My shoe. Like, if I like sit on the couch without like, with my socks on, I like pass out. I think that's fine, but I don't okay, but I feel like, here's the thing. I feel Everyone like has discovered the this the fine it's gross and if you do it you're a bad person, <coughs> Ben. But why? But why what? Why is it bad? Cause if oh. God <laughs> <laughs> If God designed you with socks on <laughs> No. But like, cause I, but it's just one of those things where it's like society's has decided it's bad and I know it's bad cause it shouldn't be done. But just why? Why is it bad? Yeah. Cause it is. Cause it's uncomfortable. Well then why do you think it's bad? That's the thing. I don't know why I think it's bad. It's like an instinct. Like, uh... What? It's an instinct to not like socks. Instinct? Instinct. I, I, I just have habit of it now. Ah, oh, dude. I just make my feet get cold. That's why I do it. Dude, do you not keep Think your feet under blankets? Pay for freaking heating. Yo, so Pay sick. for heating. Do you just sleep with the blanket on? Do you <laughs> just sleep this? with the blanket <laughs> off your tootsies? Pardon? The to your tootsies, your toes. You just don't put a blanket on them? Um, oh, I, well, uh, yeah. Well, I start if you, with that, if you just sleep with any limb out that reaches over your mattress, the devil is going to eat them. Dude, <laughs> have you guys seen the game where it's there's like monsters and you have to keep the blanket over the guy and he keeps moving? Yeah, but then there's the part I seen this other TikTok and it's like uh, if you leave any limb outside your mattress, the devil's gonna eat it. <laughs> he just puts his ass up. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I used to sleep with, I used to own, like, a ton of Beanie Boos. Like, do you guys know what those are? Like, the ones with big ass eyes? Yeah, those are big eye guys. Yeah, I had, I had, like, at least 20. And I had a bunch of, like, long snakes that were, like, the size of, like, they were, like, four feet at least. And I would sleep with them all around me, and they would protect me <laughs> so that no one could get me. And I knew, the, if anyone, if anyone came at me, they, they'd be stopped by my sheer will. Someone is putting a fan to their mic. So, yeah, sorry, the, my... The garage is opening. Nothing, I, I can't do nothing about that one. Sorry, uh, Chief. Alright, uh, I have one more thing. Yeah, okay, so, if you had to make a movie about something, what would you make it on? I mean, my movie would be bad. Nobody would like it. <laughs> but, like, what would it be? Would it be, like, a sequel to an already existing movie? Would it be a new one? Would be it would be a movie similar to another one. Yeah, I'd make pretty much a CrossFit movie again. Mine, oh, like all the originals, and they would be so good. Well, I have so many ideas, and I have a book, but I can't, ex but I can't expose them to like, so that become no a director. Them? Yeah. Can you give us a little taste? Frog. Josh, that's your cue. Frog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just a delay. You had to decide. So you're making a Beauty and the Beast live action remake? Or are you making Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with frogs? No, just frogs. Just, just cats. Just... <laughs> Alright. So that's going to be it for the podcast. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. I'm making this, baby. <laughs> I'm milking this. Dude, no Ben's one's going to want to see that. It's okay. What? Ben dead. Yeah, wait, yeah, Ben, what what movie would you make? Uh, it's the part where you talk. Hey! What's that, Ben? You would take one that I already wrote and you would put your name on it? What was that, Ben? 
earthquake. Ooh, you make my earthquake. I'm Where did that go? Day. What the heck? Cormac, say your yes. best. Who'd that movie be? What? Ben, you're Ben. You're Ben. You're Ben. Okay. Do your Ben. Be ben. Voice. Try harder. I am Ben. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's pretty I convincing. Yeah. <laughs> How does Ben hey. sound? Uh, he sounds. Hi. He sounds I'm like ben. a dude. You know what why? is wrong with you? Do you know why? Do you know? Oh, dude, what is going <laughs> on? What the heck? Dude, I'm he did like not. Stuff. He did not like your impression. He attacked, attacked his mic. Right? <laughs> he just shot at the mic. I feel my wrath. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness! Oh my goodness gracious! Oh my lanta! Oh my lanta! I haven't heard anyone say that for a little bit. You're welcome. What's an old saying now. that you wish was a saying again? Um. Don't say uh, what we know you're thinking. You do? I do. I think people still say I do a lot. Wait, no. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Hey, Ben or Cormac, just if no, it's down definitely your block ben. away from Mike. <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. He's being a bit of a nutball. What, what the? What I just it? went through the floor. You went through the floor. Do what? Yeah. Contacts or are you good? No, I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm fine. Okay, um, I'm bad. Oh, holy, okay. I'm gonna, that turn, oh, that's hot, baby. That's rewind time. How do I, I'm gonna have to. Disguise, Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, corn. Yes, sir. Oh, um, my, Jesus, stop, Lana stop. Lana or Riley? Who or who? Lana or Riley. <laughs> Uh, I'm and we're allowed to talk about this because Clark has to shut this down because he doesn't. Riley Reed. I'm. I'm gonna have to go with. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I'm Riley. Sorry, I couldn't hear you over the sound. Okay, how do I? I need to up. figure. Sorry, but I need to figure out how to get this man's out of here. Is it Ben? <laughs> yeah, it is Ben. I don't yeah. know what's going on with this thing. Just mute him if you want. Oh yeah, I don't know how. After, you, you right, you right click. Right click. After he heard, after he heard Cormac's <laughs> expression, he just he let us, his he let us and file started shooting. Yeah. Wait, it's not working. Okay, I just, oh, oh, oh shit. Ben. <laughs> ben, is that you? Ben, I wasn't gonna mute you. Wait. <laughs> okay. Wait. I, it's like alien. It's cuts back from a hand. Just Dude, you're up. gone. You just <laughs> left, and then your mic was just. <laughs> no, it's because it's because I was I had earbuds, and now I took them out. Were you punching your iPad? What was going on? Sense. How hard was that for you? To why take why would you why are you taking them out and putting them back in? <laughs> no, yeah, that's, that's not. Why no, you that's have not with the sound. Well, that's not what the sound was. What was that's that? Not what the sound was. Were you throwing Phoenix? <laughs> No. <laughs> yeah. Ben took off no. the headphones. <laughs> took off the headphones and just started sallying. He's like, Whoa. He took off the headphones and started smashing them against the wall. Work, dang it. That's so funny. He started throwing everything at the Yeah. Woo. So, Ben, you got your situation figured out here? Pardon? You got your you got know. your thing going out here, or like you good? I would Wait, say what? Lana, only because she's had less. Uh, Riley has too many bad things. Are you talking about Riley Reed? Yeah, no. and Lana Rhodes. All right, so I'm gonna <laughs> ask. Just knowing maybe one of their industries, I'm gonna ask you to not. I All right, never. that's okay. 
I would never. You just were. <laughs> no. He, no. I was thinking about that, and he was not. Oh. Yes. Were you thinking, Wait, about, were you you thinking meant, about her music? I thought you meant... I just bit Lana the bullet for you, by the way. Lana, I thought you meant Lana Reeds and... <laughs> Dude, I thought you meant Lana uh, <laughs> Lane's. Like, Lois Lane's sister. Lana. What is... Okay, stop breathing so heavy after talking about that. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> also, yeah, okay, Ben, you missed this question because you were too busy raging with your headphones. Uh, <laughs> if, you can make any, if you can make any movie, what would it be about? I was I was there for this question. I told you my answer. Was it no? No, you weren't. No, you didn't. Because it was all it was all like. <laughs> I can't hear the word you're saying to Josh, but... Something yeah. <laughs> yeah! That's me right there, baby. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, give us your answer now. I'd make the Titans curse. The third Ooh, one. Oh, okay. That's a hot take, what because the say? second one sucked. Yes. We, we And they combined the two, the second yeah. and the you, third. Would you get rid of the second one and then make the Titans curse? Uh, yeah, but I have to write the wrong first. You have to make the movie and then... If you could get rid of one thing, like one pop culture thing, what would you get rid of? The second twerking. movie. <laughs> what would you get rid of, Josh? Twerking. Is that still pop? I guess it is, yeah. Also, why? It makes me sad. Isn't it really hard, though? No. Did you say, doesn't it make you really hard, though? No, well, that would make sense, right? No, fucking... It does make sense. It does, actually. It's not that hard. But, like, to make your cheeks go, well, it is. It is hard. It, it's hard to do it with with your back and without with your back. Form. And just your bootay. Bum, bum. Yes. What about, what about you, Cormac? What pop culture thing would you get rid of? My Cyrus. I would so get rid of all yeah. the stupid, like, movements kids do nowadays. Like, dabbing and, like, the... That's not a movement. Like, that's not a movement. Like the, like, no, not, like a movement. movement. Not like oh. that kind of movement. Like, I mean, oh. like, like actual physical. The movement. dabbing movement okay. of 2016. <laughs> like I'm... renegade. Oh, it's so stupid. Yeah, like, okay. just, no, I agree. Just I would... keep your hands normally. Dude, like... I would just get rid of TikTok. <laughs> I would just yeah. get rid of it. Hear me out. Because I don't think being popular on TikTok means anything. It does. Because you have to, yeah. oh, no, was, because all you need to do a... is be Charlie, Charlie, Charlie D'Amelio is the only one that's impressive because she makes the dances. Everyone else can just copy her and be cute. And you get yeah. 300,000 well, followers. Charlie got, she got him. In... She got in the Super Bowl, right? Huh? She did, she was in the Super Bowl, right? I said there's a Super Bowl. You're, you're kind of, but I think, I think she is someone that actually deserves validation on that platform because she makes a lot of original yeah, stuff. Yeah, she gets, what, she gets made way too fun of yeah i think i think what she does is actually really impressive even if like if it is just like like tiktok girl or whatever but like i it's just so many people don't make any like people that make original content that's fine but like just bring back vine it's just worse vine yeah well, that's, so, that's what tiktok is it's TikTok worse is vine. Just, i see this i want to do that too it's worse well, there's so. a few there's a few compilations on compilations, compilations. there's a few things on youtube no yeah those are good because those are original the same energy as Vine. yeah those are and original those are, content those are pretty good. like all the original content because some stuff that's actually funny but most of it is just garbage and just i guess you can say that stuff. you can say that about every platform i guess but like at least on like every yeah, like, no, that's, youtube i think youtube is way worse but it's that. different you think about it if like there might be a thousand fortnite let's plays but each one's different gameplay and a different kid talking yeah, so each one in TikTok. Well, it's is... harder because you only have like 15 seconds of fame. No, you can get more. On TikTok? Or you can just do extended things. Like, you can do like a sketch or like those voice things. Those are fine even sometimes. But like, just the dances, they're just Fortnite dances, but worse. They're Fortnite dances because people actually try. Dude, imagine actually being able to do every Fortnite dance. People can. I feel like at this point there's so many. I'm though. playing Papa Scooper Repo. I'm 
<laughs> scoop a repo. I don't think that's what it's called there, bud. It is called scoop a repo. It, no, it's not. It's Korea. Yeah, no, it's not scoop a repo. So, okay, place a time. Seven forty-five, right? Yeah. When will Wally come visit? And I'm playing. Like... Oh, uh, seven forty-seven. <laughs> I don't know how. What do you think, corn dogs? Like, is it? Should I be Car should I be Carlo or Car Carlos or custom? No, I'm custom. No, Carlos. Carlos. Okay, what kind of hair? Definitely the blonde one. Ben hair. Ben hair. Wow, thanks for it's describing really that to the homeless. audience. Hair color? I'm color. Red. Oh, skin wait. color. Once I'm color colorblind. Blind. So. <laughs> It's it's those are shades. Papa Scoopery. <laughs> You're changing it now. <laughs> it's because there's a there's there's Papa's Bonario. There's three Ps, man. I don't think K. Hey, hear me out. Not on topic, by the way, at all. But talking about the language, I don't think it's physically possible for a human to know all languages. I mean. There, even with like in, fluent in even with in, yeah even with infinite amount of time I do not think it's possible. Uh, well, I don't know to be to have a basic understanding. Maybe like a basic like one percent of the language for oh my every gosh, language is so possible. Cool. Like I know one of my uncles or something like that. He speaks. Uh, I know one of my uncles. Too. Mandarin, <laughs> uh, Spanish, French, and English. So yeah, but you like, how well does he speak them? Like good, like yeah. That's and that's amazing. Lived in uh, what's it called? Oh, uh, Japan for a long time. But how many languages are there? Hundreds. I just don't think your a human brain has the capacity. Oh shit! Like including dead languages? Oh uh, no, no, just active ones. Well, if you, okay, if you were to learn a dead language, if you were to learn Latin, you would be able to understand almost anything. Yeah. Cause no one, cause it's not new words. Yeah. Just, they just so, took all the words and combined them. Yeah. Oh my gosh! I just made an upside down cookie and it's so sexy. Come on, Ivy. It's actually sexy. This is kitchen. Only once. What? Explain to me why ninety-three points is only one star. Uh, probably because it goes to like higher than ninety-three. <laughs> dude, I I know I know you're playing pizza secar secario or whatever it was, but like, dude, I just don't know. No, no, the guy that's like playing Minecraft until I move to the Y axis. You're playing. Like you're stuff. playing Minecraft on the Y axis in a pizza game. <laughs> Have you seen those? Jeez, your mic cut out. Have you, have you eaten what? Microphones. Micro what? My dog. My are baby, baby. All right, you're not even trying. What? All right, what's the plan now, boys? The plan is simple. Do you guys know who that is? is Actually, gonna... no, you don't. <sighs> All right. So I hope you're... this is the right ice cream. Okay, what do you think? What's the worst job for you to work then, if you're colorblind? Besides, well, so like worst job? Yeah. Artist. I <laughs> no, I think that makes you better. I know. I, I want to be in a just because it would be funny. <laughs> the, oh my gosh, this guy wants a cherry on nuts. Dude, imagine dude, imagine working your entire life to doing something because you think it'd be funny. <laughs> Alberta, you only gave me 80, $89. I only had two sales on my first day. I'm surprised. I'm two sales on the first day of a business. Actually, if it's not advertised, it's pretty good when you think about it. Oh wait, they only oh the oh I went from a newbie to a non newbie. That's the second stage. I got wait, is that game. actually the rating? Newbie to not newbie? Yeah. That's not good. Pay attention to the outfit. I'm colorblind though. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well I'm gonna end it here. Do you guys have anything to say before we go? No. Wait, are we actually going? Yeah, I'm gonna end it here. One at a time. Josh? But then are we hanging? Yeah. After? Probably like, for are you a still bit. on it? Yeah. But I'm gonna end the podcast. Okay. Do you have anything to say, Josh? 
All right, Cormac. Nope, I am good. Benny Boo. <laughs> Go yeah. subscribe. Go it's back. your boy. Walnut Shut up, dude, Go you're, Don't wreck. Like don't all the stop. Video. You're wrecking Benny Boo's thing. <laughs> he has <laughs> one chance to talk in the podcast, and you're ruining it. I I will end your career. All right, Ben, go. Hurry. Stop, dude. You have one opportunity, and you're hitting your mic. That's. Do you know what? Nah, we're done. You you wasted your chance, Ben. Freaking hitting mic. All right, thanks for watching the video. Bye bye. Dude, what a great video. That was great. I actually I actually enjoyed that. I'm not gonna lie. It's still recording. Frick. Oh no. Oh no. Good. Did I tell you how much of it? Wait, cut it.